Let's see how the favorites and grouping feature works on Spectrum results. So what I'm going to do here is launch Spectrum and I'm going to load up two projections that I have saved in my hard drive. Ghana Base and Ghana Low. And the difference between these two projections is Ghana Low has a lower projected fertility. And we can take a look at that. So what I'm going to do here is move over to Demproj Results, Fertility, Total Fertility Rate. Select OK. You can see Ghana Low with the lower projected fertility here at the bottom line. Now let's add another indicator, Total Population. So I'll show that as a line chart as well. And we now have that on our indicator tabs. OK, so now we want to add these indicators to our favorites for easy retrieval in the future. So the way to do that is to right click on the chart and move down. You'll see a selection here for add to favorites. Once you do that, you'll get a note indicating that the favorite has been added to your list. We'll say OK. And if you move up here on the display grouping, you can see that we do have total population added to our favorites. Let's try the same with total fertility rate. Right click, add to favorites, and we can take a look. And now total fertility rate has been added to our list as well. So now if we select one of these, for instance, I'll pick total fertility rate, you can see the configuration um, dialog comes up, select OK, and then total fertility rate is added to our indicator display list. Now the favorites in Spectrum are not attached to a specific projection. They're actually application-wide. So for example, if I close these two projections and load up a third projection, so I've got a medium, and then move over to my favorites. Notice that we have favorites displayed here on the home tab as well as in the modules tab. And I'm going to pick total fertility rate. Total fertility will come up for Ghana medium. You can have a maximum of 10 favorites in Spectrum. And should you reach the limit of 10, you can select manage favorites here, which will allow you to delete the favorite that you choose. I will keep them both here and cancel. And the favorites will be available even if you close Spectrum and reopen. OK, so let's take a look at the grouping feature in Spectrum. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this projection and reload our originals, which was the Ghana Base and Ghana Low. And then I'm going to re-display the favorites, total population, and total fertility rate. And let's add two more. So I'll bring up the Demproj results menu. And let's add births and deaths. And what the grouping feature allows you to do is to create a dashboard of indicators. And what you do here is you select group, and it brings up a dialog showing you the four tabs that you currently have displayed. And you can select up to four maximum to be grouped. And I'll select all four here. And you have to give it a title, so I will give it Demproj Dashboard. And I'll select OK. And what it has done now is, is taking those four individual indicators and place them into a single form. Now I can adjust form with these sliders. Depending if I want to emphasize one or the other. I can also adjust a specific 
display. So, for example, in total fertility rate, I'll pick the configure button and I'll change that to a table. Group displays can also be added to your favorites list. Just like you would with any results display, you can right click, select add to favorites, and the Demproj dashboard has been added. Select OK. So, as an example, we'll close this. I'll move up to favorites. Here's my original two, and here's my new one. And when I select it, it comes back up. So another feature of a group display is I could zoom in on a particular quadrant here. So, for instance, I can right-click here and select Zoom In, and it just zooms in on that particular indicator. And if I right-click again, I can zoom out, and then I'm back to my original group display. I can also ungroup all of these by right-clicking and ungroup and what that does now is puts them back into the display tabs as separate indicators. I could move up to my favorites list, select Mproj dashboard, and then we'll add the dashboard indicator here as expected. Great! So I hope you have enjoyed this video of how to use the favorites feature and the grouping feature in Spectrum. Thank you.